Hey guys, welcome back, and, well not welcome back, I have done this series before, but, um, I am here on my, um, sorcerer, stamina sorcerer, but apparently with the update, the bad thing, I guess, is a sorcerer has been nerfed using daggers, but I'm not a dagger user, so I guess that doesn't really apply to me. And I am here at, um, still in the new one time real, which is basically, there's no more servers separated everyone. It's basically everyone is in one server, either, um, one you are in the European server, or there was the one where you are in the North American server, or whatever. And now, um, everyone can play together, there's no more factions as well kill this guy for interrupting me. Die. Oh man. What the heck? Now I haven't... I don't really know exactly how it affects me yet with this nerf because I totally don't know what has been nerfed. 100%. So here I am apparently... What am I doing here? I don't know I'm talking to this guy. I should never have suggested fleeing. The Weirises are witches of a sort. Devoted to Witches all oh, bug, fuck out of bye. So where was I going? I don't even remember. So I'm going south. Uh, I do also play Guild Wars 2 now, thanks to um, my friend and uh, my friend if you're actually watching this you already know who you are. And so I'm actually playing both of these games because of him. And he doesn't really play the ESO as much as he used to. I play it because I like to kill NPCs. Um, Guild Wars 2 is really, really grindy. I mean, it's like Lotro. I don't want to say it's like Lotro. It's, it's. I know. Um, world, world-wise, it's uh, very fantastic. It has different. If you go around, there's different worlds there. There's like a Lotro looking world, Star Wars looking world, underwater looking world, sci-fi looking world. That's how Guild Wars 2 is. And it's also blah blah blah. I'm not even gonna... Th I'm here playing ESO, so blah. And I do have obviously a um, Guild Wars video. I did start one, but just one. I know, two videos. So here we go. So I'm talking to this guy, the Duke. <sighs> I apologize to all of you. I thought I could fight this off. I was wrong. Take this. It will help. Ah, the pain fades. That was blood, wasn't it? You gave me Gloria's blood, didn't you? Just one more thing Falchu must pay for. Complete quest. I'm gonna talk to him again. Look at him. He already stands like an annoying bitch after he um, drinks that girl's blood. So I'm gonna talk to him again. Thanks to you, my nightmare is over. It's time to return to Canlorn. What's the next step? The only benefit from my brush with lycanthropy is that now I understand the curse. How do I prevent that? I have Mage's Guild researchers already working on that problem. They're trying to discover how Falchu originally died. If you want to help... Okay, but fine. I thought I get to kill him here. I guess I wasn't able to kill him. Maybe because I killed that girl instead, I don't remember. I thought I get to choose to leave him to die. Because I remember I, last time I did this, I thought that he still wasn't healed even after that blood. But I don't know now. So, I'm going to go to two quests. Search for the missing woman. Go to the Glenumbra Moors or enter Spindle Clutch. So, north, I think. Search for the missing women. So yeah, like I said, I do have Guild Wars 2 videos, but, um, Guild Wars 2... Task for you. What the fuck is this? E. Comrade, I have an urgent message for you. What is it? Guildmaster Sees All Colors would like to see you as soon as possible. She said the journal has revealed something about the Vivicus, whatever that is. She awaits you at the Guild Hall. Where can I find her? You can find her in the Hall in Wayrest, Comrade. May the Eight protect you. Goodbye. 
So basically, since I, I think it's, uh, if you level up, every time you level up, you get a guild quest. I was actually about to talk to the stable master, and you know what I've been doing here also that I, um, do in Guild Wars 2? I keep pressing spacebar twice thinking I could fly, because in Guild Wars 2 you have gliders that lets you glide. So now I'm gonna go north for the women, but my pet is killing some bunghole over there, which I'm not even gonna bother, okay? Do I have any new skills? I think I do. Crystal shard? No, because I am a... Well, um, I'm supposed to look for the women here. And where is the women? I'm supposed to kill Wirrhesus. funny about the update, they also have increased the morale of NPCs in Daggerfall. They actually have uh, 25 to 60k morale now. A stranger who isn't dressed as a Bloodthorn? No, I'm the Queen of the Nords. Of course I'm from Camlorn. Did my brother Gee send you? I gave the cultists a hard time, so they tied me up. They took the other women away, though. I think they traded them to the Bog Hags. Uh, this girl doesn't seem very scared at all, but okay. The Bloodthorns have an arrangement with the Hags. Something about exchanging us for their help against the Weir. They eat. Please try to find my companions. These cultists are insane. But the Hags... Who knows what they're capable of. I'll go find my brother. Poor Sod is useless without me. Oh, that sounds familiar. Me! No. <laughs> yes. No. Yes. Okay, right, cool. So now I'm gonna go look for... Who? I'm supposed to go further north, search for the contract. The contract. Okay, so I guess it's north? I don't know where to go. I guess this way. Oops. Well, I think we're gonna stop here for now, and um, we will. Uh, how do I even get rid of the? Oh, I forgot this is. So, yeah, we're gonna stop this episode here for now, and um, thanks for watching. And please share, subscribe, and. Check out my video comments for... Oh my god, how fucking boring is that speech in line? Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Bye.